Okay, today we are going to be looking at something slightly different. This right here is React OS and it sort of aims to be, well, an open source Windows, I suppose. The uh, project is still in alpha and it's very much not ready for daily use. But I would say we should have a look at it anyway. Um, as you can see, it looks very sort of Windows 2000 esque, possibly. Um, another thing is the this might look a bit strange on account of the fact that I just couldn't get the VirtualBox guest editions to install. So work what with what we've got. So for a start, you've got the Windows desktop icon things. You've obviously got the my computer, the trash can, recycle bin here. Um, and then you've got a load of other stuff that isn't really on Windows. You've got my documents, my network places, applications manager, command prompts, and a readme file. Which basically just explains what it is. Um, obviously you've got some wine stuff, because yes, this, although this project is built from scratch, or this operating system I should say is built from scratch it does still use some code and other stuff from wine um, for a start I think we should take a look at what you get by default no web browser from what I can tell you a very Windows Explorer looking file manager um, as you can see you've also got folders it kinda works um, You've obviously got, um, well you've got, this is interesting here, you've got an application manager. Um, here I would think, um, probably I would think early Linux package managers and basically, let's see what there is, download, there you go, your categories here, you have the drivers, tools, libraries, whatever. So let's see if we can download it, let's download VLC to demonstrate. As you can see, it's downloading the EXE off the internet. See, VLC 2.2.2.exe, because yes, this does run .exe, it's not running its own thing, it's running Windows apps. It loads up. As with Wine, not everything will work. In fact, I'd be willing to bet that this probably has a lower compatibility rate than Wine, but this is, of course, still in alpha. Um, you can see the Windows setup there is working. As you can see, yep, Windows setup, I don't care. Um, whilst we're looking at that, let's see what else you get. You get Solitaire, and my favourite game ever, Minesweeper. So that's done. It kind of works like a normal Minesweeper. Um, obviously, the DLC has added its own folder in there. You've obviously got some administration tools, nothing great there. Get some accessories, a calculator, obviously your command prompt, your notepad, your paint, your word pad, that kind of thing. Um, if you're wondering, yes, DOS commands, they do work, but it's not, of course, is isn't the original cnd.exe. If you wanted to put that on, though, I assume you could. Um, as you will be. DOS commands do work. Um, once again, I say no web browser by default, unfortunately. Um, you've obviously got a multimedia player, a sound recorder, and a volume control. And really, application wise, that's about it. But as you can see, everything in the system does look very Windows esque. You've got a wallpaper by default. Doesn't set it automatically, though, for some reason. Screen savers do work. Got some appearance options. Uh, you've obviously got the React OS standard, but you've also got something that they're working on here, which I assume is meant to be a more modern look. Uh, unfortunately, they haven't got too far with it just yet. Kinda works though. But we're gonna turn that off because it's weird. Um, obviously. Yeah, your control panel does look very Windowsy. Kind of what they're trying to go for here. Um, 
so you know. Installation also looks very Windows XP. It's something I forgot to mention. Um, and well, at the moment that's about it. Yes, it runs your Windows apps. It looks like Windows, and a lot more to say about that. And well, I wish everyone working on the project the best of luck, and I hope that the project turns out well at the end. I guess. Uh, definitely worth checking out, but at the moment it's not quite ready for real hardware just yet. And well, that's about it. Thanks for watching.